All right, folks, I got an absolute doozy for you today. This is a show from 2016. It's called Love at First Kiss. Let me read you the synopsis here. Love at First Kiss breaks singles' boundaries by having them go beyond their comfort zones and kiss a total stranger without introduction to find out if one kiss can lead to everlasting love. If either of the pair feels a spark while lip-locked, he or she can head to a two-minute speed date, which could lead to a date in the real world where all the bets are off. There was a super viral clip that went, that was everywhere from the show, like a couple years ago. But the rest of it apparently is pretty incredible. So I hope you're wearing your best pair of undergarments. What? Mm? Don't know why I said that. Hope you're ready for some cringe. Hi. Hi. Do we shake? Sure. Oh, why was that dude's eyes open? Ugh. Psychopath, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Who kisses with their eyes open? It's gonna be great. I'm Josh, I'm 27, no pressure. And today I'm gonna kiss a girl for the first time. <sighs> okay, this is the fucking guy. <laughs> I'm pretty sure everyone and their mother has seen this clip, but we might as well just rinse it again. You know, it is a legendary clip. This guy has never kissed a girl before. And the casting directors were like, oh brother. Oh yeah, you are our golden boy right now. The only girls I've ever kissed in the world. Dude, that's are my cologne. Mom. What are you doing? I guess I'll pucker my lips and uh, I don't know. I just kind of push them forward. Pucker my lips and push them forward. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My heart is actually racing. Like my palms are are actually sweaty. I really want to fall in love. Like, what if she's the one? Damn, dude, this poor guy. I hope this works out for him. I know it doesn't. I've seen this. Everyone has. But I just, you know, for one second, I want to kind of set aside reality and just kind of just pray for this man. You got this, brother. He seems like a sweet guy, you know? Because I'll just pucker my lips and push him forward. I want to sound like a country singer there for a second, you know? I guess I'll just pucker my lips and push him forward. Pucker my lips and push him forward. I'm gonna plant one on this girl. I'm Annalisa. I'm from Beverly Hills. Am I an experienced kisser? Ah, oh, these casting directors are fucking evil. 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 Oh my god. She's even like she's even admitting. She's like, "Ah, you know, I'm uh, I got some got some kisses under the belt." All right? She kind of looks like a party girl a little bit. This is the most intimidating type of girl for this type of guy. Bar none. Guaranteed. He's going to shit himself when she walks in. He's going to forget his plan completely. He's going to be like, what was I saying about the... What do I pucker up again? Clench my ass cheeks? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Because that's what's happening. I was 13 when I had my first kiss. I made a goal to myself that I was going to be a great kisser. She's ripping a shot too? Oh my god. It took a lot of practice, trial and error. And I must say, I developed a couple of uh, tricks in my bag. Uh, good. I mean, uh, those are those will those will be staying in the bag today, unfortunately. I don't think you're gonna have to whip out any tricks. And it will pull me in and just grab my face and just kiss me. I'm ready. <laughs> oh, my oh my god! I love this. I love this. I mean, could it be like more opposite from what's about to happen? Hopefully, like my little friend stays down. Oh my god, dude. Hopefully my little man doesn't pucker up. <laughs> and then the crotch shot. He hears the heels. He's like, oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh, it's a baddie. Oh god. Oh, for fuck's sake, it's an IG baddie. No. <laughs> Hi. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Do you mind if I give you a kiss? Yes. <laughs> Do you mind if I give you a kiss? The only thing you're not supposed to say is yes. Say anything else but yes. Mine? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I mean, at least he like didn't have any time to think about it. She went right in for it. You know, that's probably the best thing that she could have done for him right there. You can see he's still in shock. He doesn't even know what's happening. He's like, has it started? Is this what it is? Is this a kiss? <laughs> and then he does it, then he's like, oh fuck, it's over. Oh fuck. Are you nervous? Yeah. Don't be. Okay. Can I try it one more time? Yes. Are you sure about that? <laughs> 
Kiss cam! That could be you at a live event. Thanks to the sponsor of today's video, SeatGeek. Listen guys, with over 28 million downloads, SeatGeek is the number one rated ticketing app. There are more than 70,000 events every single day on SeatGeek, including concerts, festivals, sports, and more. We went to Taylor Swift recently. We went to Drake recently, both thanks to SeatGeek. Here it is right here. What do we got? Raiders at Chargers. Cold play coming up on Saturday. Oh my goodness. Arctic Monkeys are playing. Actually, I kind of want to go to that. With artists like Drake, Beyonce, Five Seconds of Summer, and the Jonas Brothers on tour, you're not going to want to miss out. One of the best things about them is they put all the tickets from all over the web in one place to make buying simple and to make sure you're getting a great deal. Each ticket is rated on a scale from one to 10. So look for the green dots. Green means good deal. Red means bad deal. And SeatGeek is the only site that lets you return your tickets before the event with swaps and guess what you know you know i came through for you guys all right use my code cody co for 20 dollars off tickets at ziki that's 20 dollars off your first purchase with promo code cody co just make sure you click the link in the description to download the app all right back to the video please try <laughs> close your eyes you fucking freak <laughs> thanks it didn't feel like a kiss. <laughs> God damn it, I'm having fun. I'm having fun. It felt like I kissed his teeth. Kiss tells everything. And I wanted to feel like he wanted me. He's probably like, yeah, fucking kill me. No longer a virgin, boys. That's what's up. Should we do a lunch? Should we go out for beers with all the people that have kissed women before let's do it come on boys let's go talk about kissing and what's what's my what's our what our favorite things about it are i was hoping it'd go a lot better i feel disappointed at myself and wish i would have done things a lot differently <sighs> hey man you know that's that that was that was all of ours you know now i can tell people i've had my first kiss but i think i would have felt more confident if the first kiss went well <laughs> look at his eyes dude. There is just no life behind his eyes. He's completely like out of body right now. Completely. There's no soul in his body. He got so nervous that it was like, ah! and he just got sucked. He got sucked out of his body and he's watching himself from above like, oh, fuck. What are you doing, man? Pucker those things up, dude. <laughs> she was nice, though. It was nice for her to go for a second one. Give him another shot. That was nice for, of her. But maybe she sees potential like oh he's actually like a good guy and who knows i'm sorry man that's just not it's not happening for you today i'm sorry it's not what's gonna go down develops into a relationship maybe even my wife that'd be amazing i don't know dude you why don't you pop the question right now you know might as well see what she says i'd be really disappointed for sure if she doesn't show up to the speed date hopefully like we can salvage it no way she's actually going. No fucking way. What? You know what? Maybe she's cooler than I thought. Maybe she's nicer than I thought. Maybe she's giving him a shot. Bars. Hey. Hi. <laughs> How's it going? Good. How are you? Good. How are you doing? I actually found it. Oh, he thought she was going in for a third. He's like, oh, it's happening again. Pucker up, pucker up, pucker up. Oh, it's a hug. So cute that he was nervous. How are you feeling? It, it was very nerve wracking for me, I must say. Yeah, that was actually my first kiss ever, so. Don't say that. Don't. <laughs> Or maybe you do say that. Maybe that's, I mean, it's a pretty good ex explanation for why you suck to ass at it. I've never kissed anyone before. That's... Stop it. Yeah. Oh my gosh. First kiss ever. Yeah, you took his, you took his, his, uh, K card? You, you took his lip genity. Mm, nah. How do you feel about it? Did it, was it at least exciting? Definitely something that I got out of the way, so it's good to actually have those Fireworks, you know, so. <laughs> Don't say that, dude, this guy. Yeah, I mean, it's fucking good that I just got out of the way. It's, you know, it's whatever. It's like, it's fucking, you know, just notch on my belt. Would you be willing to kiss again or? You know, are you looking at that time? Oh my yeah, God, the time is so done. fast. We can't. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh man, I, I wish we could right now. 
I wish we could lock lips, play a little tonsil hockey. <laughs> but unfortunately, the timer's out. Ah, oh, man. Ah, oh, fuck. Wish we could. Oh, man. I hate these rules for the director. Ah, oh, curses. Oh, man. If the timer wasn't out, we'd be kissing so big right now. I would be kissing. I would. We'd be making out. But unfortunately, Hands are tied. Take me away. Ah, uh, timer's out. Gotta go. Gotta go. All right. Bye. Like press replay. <laughs> <laughs> we had a good conversation. There's only two. Doc, can you put more time on there? Ah, oh, we want to kiss. Ah, oh, wish we could. Minutes, but she wanted to reset the time, which was definitely in my favor. It was such a pleasure meeting you. It's great, great meeting <laughs> you too. I hope she wants. To great meeting you too. <laughs> Do get to know me better and. Best case scenario is she's my first girlfriend. Best case scenario is she's my first girlfriend. This guy's, I like how optimistic he is. He's killing it. You have to maintain a healthy form of optimism. You do in this life. I'm really looking forward to actually um, seeing Annalisa today and, and meeting with her and talking to her and hopefully knowing her on a, a deeper level. I'm like marrying her and like making her my wife and like having kids and like. All right, let's watch the next Love at First Kiss. I gotta get another kiss, man. I got <laughs> I have to get another kiss. Where's my wife? My name is Sarati. I'm from Texas and I'm about to kiss a guy I've never ever met before. Sarati. Okay, She's looking like a short king? This man looks pretty small. Hey. Hi. Duh. <laughs> we gotta get a replay on that. Duh. Hey. Duh. Fuck, that was perfect. Hi. What's up? <laughs> Nothing. How are you? I'm good. <laughs> so, oh, is he going right in for it? Man, he was moving quick, too. How are you? I'm pretty good. <laughs> Yeah, and I'm pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> he finished that word literally like a centimeter away from her lips. Pretty good. He said good into her mouth. Pretty good. Ooh. Ooh, that last part was a little ugh. That felt fucking weird. Bye. 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 Yeah. <laughs> How are you? Literally the perfect string of phrases right there. Hey, how are you? Pretty good. Bye. <laughs> he bit my lip, like softly, so I liked that. My kissing style was flawless. Can always leave him wanting more, so there's that. Yeah. Fucking Kyle. Kyle is a legend. Legend. Hey, how are you? Pretty good. <laughs> Bye. Boom. <laughs> I'd say that. She was pretty into it. I mean, most of the time when they kiss you, they are, so. This dude is like the polar opposite of the last homie. Yeah, I mean, they're pretty much always into me. Like, yeah, 100% hit rate, normally. No, like, the, the lip bite works literally every single time. I've kissed every single girl I've ever met, yeah. I've never not kissed a girl, actually. He just like fucking coming out of the shower. Putting on his towel. Oh fuck! You're here already. What's up? It's like, where is there even a shower in here? How are you? What? Oh man, you got me all fucking. I almost was butt ass naked. What's up? <laughs> Damn, when you put a shirt on, cover up this jacked ass body. <laughs> He's cute. He's really cute. He's so cute. Uh She's in love with him. She's in love. I hope he knows what he wants and is like gonna go for it. I got this option to go on this speed date and uh, just thinking about it. Dude, if he says no. Oh my God. It would be a little mean. It would be a little bit mean, but it would be pretty, it would be pretty fucking in character for this man, for Kyle. To just come and then fucking leave this girl smitten and then be like, oh, I don't know. I got other girls to kiss. I'm not entirely sure yet. I haven't made up my mind. We'll, we'll see, we'll see. A little like angel and demon, yes, no type of thing. Coolest guy in the world, maybe. Okay, so before we find out if Kyle comes back, we, we're back now to the other guy who is waiting for his third date with the girl that he kissed for the first time. And he's waiting there with roses. And this already is making me a little sad because I feel like I know what's gonna happen. It's taking so long. 
I'm waiting here for Annalisa to come and I'm going from really excited to like anxious, nervous. She's not showing, so. Oh. oh my God. Am I going to go on a full length date with this guy? Is that even a question? No. Annalisa not showing up, it's definitely taking me by surprise. I don't know why she said she wanted to- He's not crying. He's not crying. Dude! <sighs> My heart is broken for this man. He was envisioning a future with her. Maybe she just didn't want to hurt my feelings. Honestly, I'd rather have her told me she doesn't want to go on a se Yeah, no shit. Second date, really, than to not show up. She like a rose? Okay, <laughs> thank you. I still believe in love at first kiss, you know. It oh, that last one rejected him too. You see that? The last one went, oh, no, no, thank you. No, not from you. Fucking, how many girls have you kissed? Like one? Jesus, no thanks. I still believe in love at first kiss. You know, it just has to be with the right person. I I love this dude. <laughs> he just seems like such a nice guy and I feel really bad for him. All right, let's see if Kyle comes back. My man! Doesn't even look at her. He opens the door, he's fucking, whoa. Cool, exposed brick, sick. Looks like my apartment. What's up? How are you? I'm good. How are you? What's up? How are you? I can't complain. Can't complain. This man is just like stock phrases. I love it. What's up? How are you? Can't complain. Pretty good. Bye. Just got that good smile. You know, seems pretty energetic. Pretty cool. And it's always a uh, opportunity to improve your your game. So is that? Yeah, just using her as practice. <laughs> She's not a human being to me. She's just like a fucking practice. Okay, so tell me something funny. I see someone I like. I use a line, but it's a, it's, a, it's a confidential line. First, how about you describe your ideal guy, but don't describe me. There was a little line in there, but he kind of delivered it really poorly. What are you, like, why are you saying at the table? I would need someone who's confident, knows what he wants in life, because I'm very independent. I told you not to describe me. Describe yourself in three words. Adventurous, spontaneous, and witty. Go. Okay, uh, driven, adventurous, and... Independent. What if she's like, describe yourself in <laughs> describe yourself in three words. Uh, what's up? How are you? Pretty good. It's three phrases, it's not three words, but I just couldn't pick. You know what I want in life. Independent, strong one. What do you want in life? I want to be happy. Be what happy. Do you want in life? Make a lot of money. Okay. Of course, you know. Yeah. American dream. All right, this guy sucks, actually. <laughs> I mean, I was being ironic. I was being sarcastic before, but he, I really don't like the way that he's not looking at her when he's talking what is, he, what is he doing he's like fake confident he's like yeah fucking describe your ideal guy and don't describe me you know i'd say this girl's favorite donut would probably be a glazed donut okay bye bye what the fuck was that some kind of sex joke yeah i'd love to glaze her donut if you know what i mean i just feel like that she's not really a donut person but like when she does have a donut it's just like a glazed donut because you know how girls are so it's just just glazed donut what the fuck are you saying dude what are you saying what does that even mean what kind of Donut, are you looking for your girl to be into? Boston cream, if you know what I mean. Yeah! All right, next kiss. One time I was kissing this guy and like my lips started bleeding. Like he bit me so hard, like that would be bad. Kyle would never. <laughs> my name is Justin, I'm 30 years old and I live in San Dimas, California. Oh my God, social media director? This guy is not a nightclub promoter? Are you kidding me? One of the most absurd fits I've ever seen. I want a good, sensual, voluptuous, beautiful kiss. What is a voluptuous kiss? I gotta say, this part of the show is fucking electric. It is electric. Just wondering how they're gonna come in and then how they're gonna go for it. Hi. Hi. Okay, thanks. <laughs> oh, that was not fun to watch. That was not fun. I feel really bad. I didn't even want to kiss him as soon. Because of the fit, right? As he walked out. He wasn't very manly. Like, he was very small <laughs> okay there's nothing wrong with that okay nothing wrong look at kyle she was she was like weirded out <laughs> i don't know what that was man it's like i kissed the wall i would say that second date is probably not gonna go down thing um i'm just not you know i'm sure you're a nice guy yeah but i just wasn't you know 
You're very small. You're just very small. You're petite for a little. You're a little man. Just wasn't feeling it. Oh. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, even in this fucking drip? Even with the blue paisley jacket on. Really? You really don't want to kiss me? I mean, like, aren't we here, like, to kiss and figure out how the kiss was? I mean, isn't that... I'm not attracted to you. Okay. He looks like the fucking, like, local radio station rep for, like, a football team. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? I'm not attracted to you. Okay. Hey, that's fair enough. I wasn't yeah. attracted to you at all in the first place. Either. So... Okay. So we're on Good. the same page. <laughs> You can't fire me, I quit! I love that! Yeah, I got fucking social media to direct anyways, alright? The social media isn't gonna direct itself! Ah! Oh, he's so cute! I'm very happy to see him. Guess, nice to see guess you what I brought? What did you bring? Yes. Oh, he is kinda tall. She was just wearing heels last time. Uh, he looks, yeah, I don't know. Based on the kiss, you know, I'd say this girl's favorite donut would probably be a glazed donut. I know it because I just do. It's my sixth sense. What the fuck is this guy's deal with the donuts? What kind of litmus test is that, truly? so weird. I feel like he read that in like a pickup book one time and was like, yo, that makes so much sense. That's my new fucking thing. I guess favorite donut is a uh, regular glazed. No, it's chocolate. Oh, she's the one. Oh, my God. You're so sweet. Of course. He's like just completely lost all hope. Yeah, of course. Fucking waste my time. Chocolate donut loving weirdo. Okay, so last but not least, now this is the clip that everyone remembers, I believe. They take our man's what the fuck is his name? I forget his name, but they take our man's the guy the guy who just had his first kiss, and they give him a second shot, another woman to kiss. So he does his routine. He flosses the teeth. He fucking Q tips his ears. He's getting ready. It's important to have clean ears when you go in for a kiss. What, that's it? No, what? <laughs> what? Oh, fuck, it's in the next episode? No! Well, you know, let me know if you like this, and we'll do episode two, all right? Probably gonna get copyright claim to oblivion for this, but I wanted to do it anyways, because I, I heard it was incredible, so let me know if you want me to do episode two if you want to see how that turns out by hitting the like button, okay? Appreciate you, I love you, hi, how are you? Pretty good. Bye.